Welcome to the Manage Sales Orders video. This video shows you how to process a list of sales orders. The first thing I spot when starting my working week is the sales orders tile. I want to deliver open sales orders and track the status of pending ones. To start processing the orders, I click the tile. Here, I see a list of all my open sales orders, including the number of records. I change the view to see all open sales orders. The number of records changes accordingly. I want to close old sales orders from previous years. I simply select them and choose Close. Next, I would like to deliver all sales orders with delivery date in the last three days. I click Go. I sort the table by customer name. In the list view, I don't need the customer reference number column but I want to see the ship to address just before the printed column. I click OK. Now I choose all open sales orders of the customer microchips and copy them to a delivery. I review the delivery before adding it and choose the Add and Back option. At the end of the week, I want to see all orders created during the week with their status. I add the status column to the table. I add the posting date field to the filter. And I define this week. I clear the status and choose Go. I think it is a good way to summarize each week, so I will save this view for future use by me and my colleagues. I click the Views menu and choose Save As. I enter a unique name. I choose Public to allow other users to use this view and click OK. My view is now listed in the Views menu. Next, I save this view as a tile so I can access it easily from the home page. Here is an order I delivered this week. I want to check if it was invoiced. I drill down to it and generate the relationship map. Note that I can drill down to the documents in the relationship map. I go back to the sales orders list to show you that I can present the list data as a chart. Note that the display mode of the list, meaning table or chart, can be saved as part of the view. The CEO asked me to print open sales orders of a certain customer, so I choose them and click the preview option. The print preview opens in a separate tab. I review the orders and print them from here. This was the Manage Sales Orders video. Thanks for watching.